So the what on why I chose Wagner was I was teaching in a school of business. It was a perfectly lovely place, and I got to teach uh, courses that are not terribly dissimilar to what I teach now. But it was not committed to the kinds of things that I care about in the world. And I knew that I wanted to be in a place where other people were driven by doing something about a collection of very different types of social issues. So I had the what wrong in my previous place. The second is how. How do we do it here? Something that is different about the Wagner model from the, the professor um, point of view, schools can have different focus, right? Uh, lots of uh, schools of public service or public affairs are embedded in a university where the faculty's tenure homes are in discipline departments, and they do some teaching in the School of Public Affairs. At Wagner, all tenured faculty have their tenure homes here. Our primary business is master level edu education in, pu in public service. All of our faculty teach at the master's level. It's a smattering of other things going on, but this is what we do. And for delivering good professional school education, I think that's the right model because you're not a side activity of what we do. And then the last part had to do with match. Uh, people here do a lot of different things. We have a health program, we have urban, we have nonprofit, we have finance, we have policy. From my perspective, as somebody who works on urban issues of poverty and spatially concentrated poverty, that's ideal because all of those things matter. I started out doing things that focused on poverty. Now I do housing. I care about nonprofits because they're main delivery mechanism in communities of, of color. Uh, there was a national demonstration that we just did in the last uh, decade to try to figure out the connection between neighborhoods and employment and education outcomes. And guess what? What really happens in poor neighborhoods is the impact on physical and mental health is profound. That's the biggest first order effect, and it may be the mechanism through which some of these other things happen. And I'm in a school where I have colleagues who know all about that. So it's all within one umbrella, instead of being a narrowly defined place. So if you care about those kinds of issues, which are very multi-pronged, even if you're taking one of the prongs, the match can work really well because there's somebody else here who knows a ton about it.